house is condemned? Destruction on the clinic? Uh. It's done. Any further instructions, Mrs. Cassidyne? No, I'm clear. Is something wrong? Hi. Uh. Um. Because the haunted star is gonna blow sky high tonight with every one of them on board. You found this on the docks? Yeah, Pier 54. I didn't really think anything about it. When I saw it, I, I thought it was cute, so I brought it home. And then when Brad told me what it meant, I gave it to him. Yeah, I'm sorry, Sam. I had no, no idea. No, no, no. Oh, please, no need to apologize. I'm so sorry for overreacting. Sam, are you sure that that's the uh, same one? Yeah, I am. Look, we put your anniversary on the back. Okay, this is just weird. You're telling me that this was on your bureau and then somehow it ended up on the docks? Oh, well, what's weirder is that you were even down there. We hardly ever make it to the pier. Well, that's going to change now with this new job. I was down at the site with Michael, looking at the spot for the new clinic. And when, when was that? Uh, well, it was that right after I treated Jake, so I guess it was yesterday morning. You mean the John Doe? Yeah. Wait, what? Jake was brought into the hospital yesterday. He was found passed out on the docks. Let me know. Well, Judge Lasser is reviewing the evidence. It shouldn't be long before she signs off on a warrant. Okay. Yeah. Please tell me that you're walking through the front door. Oh my God, Mac, I'm so sorry. You forgot. No, no, I didn't forget. I didn't, I just, I got pulled into something that's taken a while. Nathan, you promised. I know, I know, I'm sorry. I'll be there as soon as I can. It's okay, I understand. I have uh, plenty here to keep me busy. Carly's bartender, Jake, is working the party. Uh, Jake Doe, he's there with you? Yeah, he's working with the catering crew. Why? Nothing at all. I'll be there as soon as I can. Are you with me? You seem a little lost. <laughs> no, sorry. Um, I, I was just wondering where I should put the empties. Why, don't tell me you polished off a bottle already. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, you know, I'm just planning ahead, trying to do a good job. Oh, okay. Well, uh, don't worry. The barbacks are going to handle the empties. You can store some back here, but you're going to have enough to deal with just tending the bar. Okay. I'll start bracing for it. You better. It's going to be quite the party. You made it. I uh, thought you were going to change. I was going to, but I'm, I'm here on official police business. Jake was found passed out on the docks. They brought him into the ER and I treated him. And then Michael and I went down to look at the waterfront. We crossed through Pier 54, and that's where I found your phoenix. Ah, oh, that is the same morning that I noticed it was missing. Do you know what this means? When I said that I thought I heard something, Jake broke into the apartment. Jake? Yeah. I got a feeling we need more ice. What do you mean, police business? Nathan, can I do something for you? He said that he's here officially. Is something wrong? Yeah, I'm afraid so. What? Jake Doe, placing you under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, the court will provide one for you. On the next General Hospital. I hope that Heather Weber draws and quarters Nina. I've got a surprise for you. I owe you an apology. You cannot go to that party. Something about this does not add up. But where were you? 